Okay, I was gonna think of a dirt, dirty joke, but I forgot. Yo, yo, YouTubers! Welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario! Um... I forget what we did last time. I think we did... Oh yeah, now I remember. We did, um... All the errands for a Koopa Coot. So in this one... So in this part, we're actually gonna be covering the rest of Tasty's recipes. Um, as far as I know, we've done about 12 of them so far. So we'll be covering the rest in this part. So this may be long, maybe short, I don't know. Now, off screen I did do a bit of item selling and buying, plus getting plus getting a few items I uh, that I um, had in storage for a while. So yeah, we've got quite a ways to go. So, let's see taste tea. Yes. Um first, a jam and jelly. Combined with a mushroom. And you will get... The Jelly Shroom. Restores 5 HP and 50 FP. Ugh, that's gonna be a bit of a tongue twister throughout this part. Good for FP, bad for HP. <sighs> Michael Lester, quit fooling. That's better. Okay, next one. Another jam and jelly. But this time with an ultra shroom. And you'll get probably the best item in the game. The Jelly Ultra! Restores 50 HP and 50 FP. Probably the best recovery item in the, in the entire game. I don't think any item can restore more than that. Yeah. Alright, next up, this is a single ingredient item. Just a fire flower. And, wait a second. You get... Spicy soup. Restores 4 HP and 4 FP. Yeah. Now, sorry if you heard that little uh, clickety-clackety there. I actually have a list of all the ingredients and the easiest ways to, I mean, all the recipes and the easiest ways to, to make, to make them. Uh, some, some recipes have multiple ways of making them. So, what, what I'll be showing you is probably the easier ways to get, to get them without spending so much and stuff. Let's see, what next? Uh, hang on a second. Okay, next one. We need the dried pasta. Alone. And we get... Lots and lots of spaghetti! <laughs> yep, spaghetti! Restore 6 HP and 4 FP. Alright, next one. This one's for the dried shroom only. Yes, a useless item like the dried shroom. Whoop! <laughs> Whoops. Uh. So yeah, just a dried shroom. Surprise, surprise. And we get fried shroom. Uh, not sure I'd enjoy eating one of those. Now, some of these cooked up items I'm not going to use at all. Except the Jelly Ultra, I'm keeping that. But, yeah, some of these I'm probably just gonna sell for coins, because I've been doing some calculations for Rip Cheeto down in the to Toad Town Tunnels. You actually need a, you'll actually need a ton of money to get all the items he's got. So yeah, most of these are going bye-bye. Well, most of the new stuff we got. Sea Jelly Ultra sells for 150 coins, uh, Jelly Shroom for 75. Uh, sadly, I know you may think this is a waste of a jam and jelly, but, well, it's needed for 100%. No one said 100% also means a perfect game. So, I'll be cutting out all the selling and buying and stuff, and I'll only be seeing you guys when I, um, actually, uh, you know, do the recipes. So, I'll see you guys in a bit. And we are back for the next batch. 
Alright, so next, we're going to mix together the mushroom with a fire flower. And for this, we get the hot shroom. Restores 15 HP and 5 FP. What won't they think of next? Alright, so next. Cake mix. With honey syrup. And you get... Honey candy. Very sweet. And I do mean sweet. Next one. Cake mix again. With mushroom. And I hope I got this right. Aha, we got shroom cake. Is that a shroob on top of that cake? Well, I think maybe now we might know how the shroobs came to be even though I've never played Partners in Time. And I've heard it's not all that not all that great. Pretty much just like um, Superstar Saga. Now, I have Superstar Saga and Bowser's Inside Story, but I never got Partners in Time. Well, I don't know if I'll ever get it at this rate. But, yeah. Okay, now, there actually is one item here in Yoshi's Island that I never knew about until now. Until just before this recording, I did a pra I did a small practice run to see if I knew what I was doing. But according to the book, there's one item you can get by through um um basically a a cake item. And luckily, I still have this regular cake in storage. So I'll talk to this yellow Yoshi. Huh? Something smells really good. Is that delicious smell coming from something you're carrying? Whatever it is, I want to try it! Come on, what is it? So apparently you can give the Yoshi one of these. Um, I only tried it with a regular cake. I'm not sure about shroom cake, honey candy, or anything else, but... Yeah. Give him a cake. And in return, he'll give you... A Yoshi's favorite fruit. A melon! I honestly never ever knew about this till now. It's amazing what you can learn when you're doing 100% runs. Let's try with the other items. It turns out all those um, all those other things can be traded in for melons, which restore 15 HP. Um, there is one um, there is one recipe we can use for these, but you know, now I don't know why I just traded them all in like that. I really only need one of these. Did I? Yeah, I think I did, so I guess I kind of messed myself up there. Oh well, we can always sell the melons. Okay, on the way back, I also picked up a couple of strange leaves from uh, in front of Boo's mansion. So, just give her a melon. Now her text here is actually a little different. It smells delicious. Here we get a special shake. Restores 20 FP. Now with this special shake, yes, put in special shake with a strange leaf, and you'll get something very special. Right, Tasty? Sweet success. One of her best specialties. What do you know? So one of her specialty dishes is the healthy juice. Restores 40 FP. Oh yeah. I honestly never knew about the melon until I until I re-looked up these um these recipes. Isn't it amazing how that works? Alright, so next. We need Wacka's bump. Surprisingly. With a strange leaf, I believe. Get another specialty dish. The Deluxe Feast. 
restores 40 HP and 40 FP. Wow, we. We're really getting a lot of these things, ain't we? And I just messed up again. Apparently, you do need the me another melon for something else. So, be right back. Okay, while well, we're making another cake here, I think I may not be able to get all the recipes after all. I actually have two more recipes that call for a jam and jelly, but I only have one jam and jelly left. I may need to resort to the little oinks to get that, so... Maybe one of the jam and jelly recipes will have to wait till after... Uh, maybe after this part's recorded? So, yeah, I guess I kind of dug my own grave there. Well, that's the funny thing about Let's Plays. Not everything goes as you plan. And if you wonder when we're going back, I need to get another melon. Since I sold them all. Alright, so what we need the melon for is... Wait, what? Okay, yeah. Sorry, I was a little lost there. We need the melon. And cake mix. So we can make... A Yoshi cookie! <laughs> Literally. Kind of funny. Alright, next up. Just the egg. You can get those on the bottom of Mount Rugged. It's hidden in one of the bushes, though. And we get fried egg. Personally, I'm not a big fan of eggs. Now, next calls for another egg. But this time, with a fire flower. This one's actually kind of funny. Funny combination. We get an egg missile, which can damage an enemy. Um, one thing I sh I I don't know if I remember I mentioned it or not, but like I said, some mes some some recipes only require one item. Well, one specific item, which can be made at random. It's mystery. As you can see, I did a lot, a lot more buying and selling. Uh, mystery can become any any of the recipes, so I'm just going to try that out after I'm done with this. So just the apple alone. That will give you... The Super Soda. We all know those. Alright. Next, we need the Mushroom, and the Life Shroom, shockingly. For... some Shroom Steak. Yeesh! That doesn't sound delectable to me. Maybe to these guys here in Toe Town, but... Yeesh! Okay. Now it's time for a little gambling. No, not yet. Next, the Super Shroom. With the Jam and Jelly. Yep, this is this is one of the two Jam and Jelly recipes I was talking about. Um, the other one requires Jam and Jelly with a cake mix. So there we get Jelly Super. So yeah, I don't know if I'll be able to get another jam and jelly. I doubt it, but yeah. Anyway, let's go ahead and try out all of those mysteries. See what we get. Let's see what we get. Okay, apparently mystery failed us. Um, if you... If you don't get anything, in, if um, you give her a bad ingredient or a bad combination, you'll get a mistake. So it only restores 1 HP, 1 FP. 
Let's try this again. Just mystery. She says something different there. Let's see. Okay, that's better. Um, for a volt room, you normally need to use a dried fruit with a mushroom. Now I know what I need, what I need that dried fruit for. In fact, I can still use it. Uh, use the volt room with the dried fruit. And you get Thunder Rage. Electrifying, isn't it? Alright, let's try mystery again. Sheesh. So we got another mistake. Let's try it one more time. And we got the Egg Missile. We already went over that. No more mysteries for me, thanks. So, let's just sell off what we don't need or don't want. And, yeah, I'll be right back. Now, in the comments of one of the previous parts, uh, some, someone sent out how I can get one of the bad, a badge I was missing here. Um, in Shiver City. Um... I'm not exactly sure how it's supposed to go, but... Oh! Huh. Well, what do you know about that? I honestly forgot about this. No, wait, I don't think I ever even knew about it. Aha! Here it is! Attack Effects E-Badge! Mm-hmm. We got A, B, C, and now E. Mm. Let's go ahead and put that one on. See what that sound makes. <laughs> Yoshi. That's kind of funny. Alright. Let's get back. Let's get back to Toe Town. And we're back, and did we do a lot of buying and finding? Ugh. You know, I'm probably just gonna stick to characters like Mario, because those flying guys just. They're just annoying. Alright. So, first, just the ice potato. I think. Let me check. Nope, oh, with the fire flower. And you will get. Frozen fries. Mmm, I love fries. Alright. I'm um, sorry if I'm pausing in between these recipes. I'm just checking off my list as I go along. So as I don't, you know, do the same thing more than once. Alright, now the lemon alone. It doesn't have to be the lemon, but like I said earlier, I'm just doing the easier way to get, to get some of these recipes. So, for the lemon, you get Tasty Tonic. Okay, next up. Let's see, a lime. With the cake mix. Well, we had lemon candy earlier, which are Quizmo. So, that means we should also get lime candy. Hmm. What won't they think of next, huh? I mean, what won't they think of next? Okay, next up, we need a mushroom with a goom nut, and you will not believe what this makes. What? A Voltrum? That's not right! 
Hang on a sec. Be right back. Okay, let's try this one again. I was supposed to get something different. Okay, mushroom. Goom nut. Another volts room? Okay, something's totally wrong here. The book told me that that one of the ways to get this item is with a goom nut and a mushroom. The item I'm looking for is a life shroom. I'm supposed to get a life shroom here. Not a volt shroom. Ugh. Oh, things just aren't working well, are they? Well, well we still have one more goom nut. We can still do more of these. So with the goom nut... And dried pasta... get a bland meal. If it's bland, it doesn't sound very delicious. I don't know what the heck's going on with that life shroom. Well, at least now you know how to get more free life shrooms. Well, at least I thought you'd knew. You would know from this. That's that Let's Play curse. When that takes effect, nothing goes your way. Alright, now with a strange leaf, and a volts room, thank goodness we have those. I think I got this right. You will get a dizzy dial. Not like I need any of those. Alright, now let's try the goom nut, let's try the life shroom thing a different way, a different way. Mushroom! Boy, am I smart. Okay, so I'll scratch that then. So instead, we'll use the apple. The cake mix. Let's make one of my favorite desserts. Some hot apple pie. Hey! <laughs> that looks just like the kind of McDonald's. Nice. Okay, now that I have a mushroom in hand, let's try this differently. I will get that life shroom one way or another. So this time we'll use the goom nut first, then the mushroom. If this gets me another volt, another volt shroom, I'm giving up. Clearly something's wrong with that book. I'll have to look back into that one later. Anyway, with a fire flower and a cake mix. You'll get some fire pop. It, rest it restores 20 FP, but it'll cost you 1 HP. Yeah. I can understand that. Something spicy like that. Huh. Okay, next one. Cake mix. Life shroom. which I bought at Pooh's Mansion. And we shall get... some sweet shroom! You know, that actually looks pretty good. I suppose it's a good thing we, get, we got that Volt Shroom, because we need it. With cake mix. We're using a lot of cake mix in this thing. And ironically, I'm on practically an hour into the recording. Well, well, uh, plus interruptions. And here we get the Electro Pop. Um, according to the book, not only will it restore 15 HP, but will also have Mario temporarily electrified, like it, like with Zap Tap. So that's nice, a double deal. Alright, next up. I've been meaning for this for a while. 
Cake mix, of course. The legume nut. And for this one we get... A big cookie. What? That should be plural. Those are two cookies. Are they? Or are they supposed to look like a Goomba? You know, looking at it from a certain angle, I think it is supposed to look like a Goomba. Huh. Well, you learn something new every day, I guess. These next few recipes aren't going to require a lot of cake mix, so... If you're following along with me, you are going to need to come back to the toy box a lot. And I do mean a lot. Because at the moment, we are not finished with getting all that cake mix yet. Well, right away, we may as well get a few more coins in. If they'll give it to us. Um, in case some of you are wondering how I'm KOing them in one hit without going into battle, it's because I have the first attack badge on. Let's Mario destroy a weaker enemy with a first strike. And spin attack, too, just in case I... Well, just because I want to get going in a hurry. Won't work on Anti-Guy, and I'm still going to fight him eventually. Uh, probably once I'm done getting the rest of Star Pieces and Badges I can get. So yeah. Alright, so our next one. An egg? Here's one of our five strange leaves I picked up along the way. And you should get... Boiled egg. Wow, not really much of a sprite difference, just a tilted egg. Oh well, so what can you do? Okay, next. We need the coconut. Which ain't crystal. With a cake mix, again. And you will get... Cocoa Pop. <laughs> That's kind of funny, Cocoa Pop. <laughs> I'm cuckoo for Cocoa Pops. <laughs> oh, brother. Alright. Next one. Now let's see. It was Cake Mix. With a strange leaf. And we should get... A strange cake. Wow. That really is strange. This electrifies Mario, turns him transparent, or makes him sleep. So basically, the strange cake is another gamble item. Yeah, I'm not gonna try using that thing. <laughs> there's another, there's another Amazing Daisy. Perfect. You know, just for the fun of it, I'm going to show me getting this guy again. As soon as we can get this crazy daisy out of the way. Ah! I didn't mean like that, though. Uh, it's just like before all over again. Well, another star storm, I guess. Better than nothing. See if I can do it again. Make quite a few bad change badge changes this time. Let's see how much this will do. Holy crap! Did you see that? Ooh, I'm feeling rather explosive. Let's have amazing easy go out with a bang. Or not. Wow. Wow-wee! 
I honestly never imagined they'd level up just like that. <laughs> Alright. Let's go with BP. I swear, every time I, I find a crate in a Maisy Daisy like that, I am so going to try and take it down. In editing, you won't see this, but I'll say this is one long-ass recording. Lackluster is doing it again. So with Ice Potato only, you will get something people some some people will like, some people won't like. A potato salad. <laughs> kind of reminds me of something I saw on a, on, on a Garfield DVD I have. <laughs> He was having a midnight snack, and he actually jumps into a bowl of potato salad. And he says, So this is what it feels like to be potato salad. Yuck. Alright, so strangely, but nice potato. I think I got that right. Yep, I did. And you'll get something I wouldn't have expected. Now it's delicious. You get a yummy meal. That doesn't really look yummy to me. But if Tasty and the game say so, I guess it is. Whatever. Alright, next. Let me see. A strange leaf again. This time with one of the one of the one of the berries from Flower Fields. Doesn't have to be blue, it can be blue, yellow, or red. And you'll get another useless item. A sleepy sheep. Boo! Yeah, I know it's supposed to be bad, but, you know, I was trying to make a pun there. And I bet it wasn't very punny, was it? Yeah, you're probably gonna facepalm yourself after hearing that. Okay, this may be the last one, because I don't know of any others at the moment that I can really do, so here we have the strange leaf and a dried fruit and you will get a fire flower which I think is kind of funny at least now we know how fire flowers are made <laughs> yeah, sort of Okay, and with that, I think we're pretty much all settled. Uh, minus the two recipes we are unable to get for some reason. One of them, I need an ingredient. I need one more rare ingredient. And the other, I'm having a hard time figuring out how to get to work. If you know what I mean. So, I think we'll just end this off here, so. And not bye. So, next time on Paper Mario, we will, yeah, basically do the remaining subquests and quite possibly finally get to Anti Guy. Yeah, I'm sure some of you have been, wa been waiting for that one. Um, yeah. Now, I'll probably start the next part with a, with a subquest, which I actually kind of like, by the way, because. <laughs> That's one way to hit the save block. Um, anyway. Actually, I think I'll save that for the next part, so... Yeah, until the next time, YouTubers. On that note, I take my leave. Oh, <sighs> am I busted. And by busted, I mean tired. Duh.